All right, YouTubers, <clears throat> you ready for some cooking? Some of you might like this. Some of you might not. So I'm going to turn the induction cooktop on, Copper Chef pan in there. <clears throat> I got some, this is very good olive oil. This is a uh, blood orange infused olive oil. We're going to put some of this in the pan and let it warm up. Okay. Now, I'm playing with something here. I don't have any everything that I would like. So uh, let's see what I can do with what I got. Being the problem is uh, I don't have fresh vegetables right now. See that heating up in there. Wish you could smell that. That orange comes through. It's really nice. All right, we're back. That oil's getting warmed up. And what we're going to do now is something that some of you probably aren't going to like. You're probably going to go, all right, I'm done. But we're doing meatless. And this stuff here, I've had it before. It's actually not that bad. Even without seasoning up too much, it's it's not bad at all. This is uh, chicken tenders. It's meatless, obviously. It's got soy and gluten-free. All right. It's like uh, chunks of fake chicken. <laughs> I'm going to add a little bit more olive oil in there. I'm... Now some of you, if you can't do meatless, you can't do meatless. If some of you can, this stuff really isn't that bad. I was uh, pleasantly surprised. I still have a lot of learning to do to try to put this stuff in there every now and then. but. And I have some Famous Dave's Country Roast Chicken Seasoning. And there you go again. Um, some people like Famous Dave's and some people think it's terrible. I guess a lot of times it depends on the ones you go to. Uh, I've said before I lived in Denver. We had one for in Denver and it was actually very good. Alright, so I'm going to put some of that seasoning in there. Okay. Put a bit. Oh, that smells with that and the orange. Yeah. All right, and this is gonna take gonna take a little bit. This will probably take about ten minutes on medium low. I'll add more olive oil from time to time, and we'll come back when it's time for something else. We're gonna turn the air off for a minute. It's hot though, hot and muggy. But uh, this has been going. I've added more seasoning and oil throughout it. It's doing pretty well. We're going to add some other stuff to it. Again, I don't really know how to cook meatless, but I just had an idea. All right, we're going to do a cross. So that is Bush's Spicy New Orleans Red Beans. We're going to put those in there. Make it kind of a Cajun thing, right? Mix that all up. And then, I'm going to try to give it a little southwest kind of thing. We're going to put some corn in there. Use what you got. Smells good. Hit it with a little bit more Famous Dave's. Give it all a good coat. Just bring this up to heat. Alright. I think this might turn out. That actually smells pretty good. It really does. Like I said, that fake chicken, that brand's not terrible. It's not that bad. It doesn't make you cry. Like, I know what chicken's supposed to taste like. Should I give it a hint of sriracha? Yes. Yes, I should. I'm not gonna... Just a little bit. Just a taste of it. For now. If it's terrible, I just coat it and everything turns out better. We're almost there. 
turn it off. Should have turned it off instead of just unplugging it, but it worked. All right, what we got now is tortilla. So we're gonna put some of this on there. I got some cheese. Pretty simple. After a tough day of driving, there's no need to play around too much. We'll hit it with the sriracha, just a little. So let's give this a try. There you go. I should have lettuce. I should have a hundred things. If you had a hundred more things, put a hundred things in. This is what I got. That is, there's nothing disappointing. That's very good. I could do that again. All right, YouTubers, have a great and wonderful day. Every now and then, sneak something a little bit healthier in. That's good. All right, tomorrow's probably going to be a big juicy steak. But maybe by doing this, I'll reach some kind of balance. <laughs> I had to eat another one, you know, for the flyover. It doesn't look bad at all, does it? Really pretty good. Put some cheese on there. Try to limit it. Don't go crazy. If a little cheese is good, more is usually better. And honestly, this didn't need this sriracha to save it. This was pretty good as it is. Alright, back to that great and wonderful day thing.